Welcome back to Let's Play Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door. It's time to solve the mystery of this pristine, serene plaza. This place actually looks pretty cool. I know, right? I'm, I'm waiting for that giant tower in the background to unfold and there just be a giant chain chomp back there. How did you know to do that? I kind of figured, because I saw there was a pipe back there. It looks like that was on a pipe. It oh, just... God, I didn't even see that. Yeah, you, you gotta keep your eyes open. You, I mean, you play a lot of Nintendo games. You should know this by now. I mean... Yeah... But it doesn't mean I was paying attention to the background. I didn't even see that pipe back there. So there's a... There's a ship dock over there. But does us no good over here. Alright, amazing Nintendo player. Sh oh, now I see it. <laughs> ah, well, you see that there is another pipe and a switch on the oh other side! God. Whoa! Look at smart man UDJ figuring out this 15-year-old Nintendo game. Look at that! Using the power of my eyes, I can see sights unseen. Next you're gonna tell me this guy's got two eyes. Come on! I'm pretty sure you can connect two and two and know what to do next. Um... Okay. Paper airplane... over to the ship dock. Eh? Nah, we just Yoshi flutter over to it. Oh. Well, that seems like a bitch of a platforming segment. I'm doing this a little bit prematurely, but we can still do stuff in here. Oh, is this like the boss arena or something like that, but we need to go find the boss. Um. Ooh. A lot of doors here. I'm thinking, oh, jeez, what's this gonna be now? Welcome to the Elite Four. You may battle them in any which way you please. Beyond, beyond, beyond. Complete all seven before, before. Uh, basement four. There's oh, don't the... get that. So there's the two B4s. Uh, beyond, that, that, that doesn't translate to any number. Ooh. It's over here. No way to break that. That's just indestructible. Break that, though. No way I can hit that up there, not even with Bobbery on my side. Four stones, twin stones, two are one, one is two. Okay... So Master of Shadow and Dark, does that mean Vivian can help me to... Uh, I can help you sink into the ground, Mario. Of course not. Damn. Yeah. Okay... So this is Riddle Tower. There are eight rooms, eight <laughs> puzzles to solve. That's actually what it's called. That's hilarious. All you see isn't all there be. Stones have power of stars. Touch it to pass through it. What you... Fucking... What? Maybe that was the room where you just sink into the ground. Okay, what about this one? Another empty room. What? What? Oh, uh. Hey! Whoa! Aha. The unseen may yet be felt, so that we the Great Ones, be it here, be it there. A palace key! Alright, that's, that's, that's one. Seven more to go. Well, let's ignore those three for now and move on to the second floor. Maybe we can get a better grasp on what to do here. Ooh, perspective. Start with this one. You must make a sacrifice to revive the dry bones. Who will you go without for the rest of the game? Ew, what? <laughs> Oh wow, another Dark Bones. Guess they just want me to kill all the Dry Bones in here and then we get it? 
You must live a pacifist lifestyle. Do not destroy any of the dry bones in order to get the palace key. I do. Oh. Oops. <laughs> you walk yeah, into, yeah. You walk That's into the next dude. riddle room and it just says, Please sweep up the floor. It is very dusty in here. Uh, d d clap three times. Okay, okay good. Yeah, here, here, here's your key. Get out of here. You see a guy in a corner, and he, he, there's a pencil and paper in the middle of the room. He's like, I ran out of riddles. Write your own, dude. Ooh, a pink bones. This one loves you. Let fall the weakest, and the skies that lie then go ah! to the str- I was right! Oh, I gotta go from weakest to strongest, damn it. I mean, I was close. Ah, uh, uh. shit, shit, shit. So, which one's the strongest, Dark Bones? Well, let's check the tattle log here. Oh. So many, so, so many we've missed, I feel. All right, so uh, going down, we got uh, Dark Bones, which mm -hmm. is obviously the strongest, pretty clear. Uh, next is... Dry Bones. Dry Bones with eight, Dull Bones with one. So and, uh, be. pink bones. The red bones is five, so... Dull, red, dry, dark. Okay. Oh, this means we need to go through four different battles. Oh, man. Yeah. We gotta make sure we get the right one, too. Come here, come uh... here, come here, come here. Oh, this is probably gonna kill him as soon as you get into the arena. Yeah, ah! like... <laughs> <laughs> you know, I, I think it would have been more effective comedically, comedically had you fallen from the sky and destroyed him. <laughs> All right, red bones. Yep, got him too. Oh God, this is a massacre. Now for dry. Thing is, dry and dark like to hang around together, so. I mean, had I not had the context of the game, I would have just assumed these were like things that go wrong with your eyes. Like, you've got a dull red dry eyes right now. And then dark could describe, you know, shopping bags under your eyes. Well, we've got some Visine to take care of that. And the Visine is Mario. Let's Super get... Mario Visine! Ho ho! <laughs> oh man, if Nintendo branches out and just has a whole line of useless, uh, or I shouldn't say useless, but just strange items to put Mario's face on, it'd be Visine, maybe Contact Solution. Uh, what the hell? That's terrifying. Did it just drop asbestos all over it? Asbestos, excuse me. I think there were a bunch of bugs. Ew. Maybe it was asbestos. So that that was it, right? That should have been it, right? We Except, did it right, right? Didn't red bones have more? Hey! Oh, okay, good. Poof. Red had five, dry had eight. Oh, that's right. Why couldn't they just have the chest up here? Why did you need to hit the button? Maybe where I could be standing would have messed up things. Like, I could have been standing right there when the chest appeared and that uh, would have fucked things up. Oh, that makes sense. And Mario falls through the floor and it becomes unwinnable and... Uh, just bad time. Ha! <laughs> this is the same thing. <gasps> or is it? Uh -huh. Oh! Oh! So destroy these blocks up here, and they're destroyed down there as well, which means... Oh, cool. Go back down to the first floor. Back to that room. I'm waiting with anticipation. Show me the changes. Hey! Whoa! That's nuts! What a brain teaser! Mm. 
Uh, let me think. How old was I back in 2005? Let's see. Minus 15. Three. God, I'm a youngster. Young man. Yeah, don't you know? You're like 17 right now, and I'm 52. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I remember when we started Let's Playing. I was 24, and you were 105. It's crazy. I mean, by the time we retire from Let's Playing, I will have been 8, and you will have been 17. It's nuts! Age ain't nothing but a number, after all. No, that's right. I mean, I don't know what you guys are talking about. This is my ninth year of being 20. Hey! Okay, so three of the eight riddles down. Four of the eight riddles. Yes, four. Now we move on to the next one. Straight on, straight onward. We know the stars spurn us, destroy all in your path. That sounds like a bobbery thing. Uh, let's see. Uh, straight on, destroy all in your path, that's... Yep, uh-huh. Uh, go to the middle of the room and use fly. So that's five. We got three left. I never understood the fascination with, you know, Pokemon, Ruby, and Sapphire and using Braille. I mean, that was probably a uh, kid's first experience with Braille. And you couldn't feel it, so it was kind of pointless. And, of course, all of your blind players wouldn't be able to figure it out either. That one was easy. Very easy. da -da. So now it's the matter of those other three, or other two downstairs. These eight keys, are they all going into the same door, or where are they going? Does this answer your question? Uh, no. Well, there you go. <laughs> I didn't answer my question! That means it won't get answered. But uh, this is why I'm a little early coming here. I don't have the star key to activate things, but might as well take care of these doors now while we have the chance. Look at you sequence breaking Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door. I know. I'm t Are you a speedrunner? Nobody has beat this game faster than I have. <laughs> all you, all you yeah. see isn't all there be. Touch it to pass through it. Is this another, like, blow the sticker out of the way or something like that? Am I, like, do I jump for it, or...? Hmm. Uh, activate the kill screen. Maybe Miss Mouse can help us out? Well, what? What's near us? Use a little bit more uh, specifics than that. Oh, wait! Uh, walk towards the fourth wall. Maybe? God, that'd be a cool reveal. Or help well. us out, Gumbella. There's something fishy about the wall here. Uh, it's not the fourth <laughs> wall, it's the third wall! What?! I thought you tried that! I swear you went up against that wall. Alright, whatever. By the way, have you ever experienced 4D? 4D? 4D, yeah. No. Like, you're watching a 3D movie and your chair reacts to the stimuli on screen? Oh, that? Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah, like once when I was on the Navy Pier at Chicago. What a gimmick that was. What a tourist trap that was. Mm -hmm. Now what about this ship? Beyond, 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 before, before. Beyond, beyond, beyond. Before, before. Okay, maybe it's the other way around. Or not. 
The word beyond probably refers to away from the door, so that means the left block. So number four must refer to the right block. The way the repeat must have something too, so alright. Three to the th three to the left, two to the right. Seven? Complete all seven, so maybe I gotta do uh I gotta do it seven times. Right? I mean Uh Alright, while we're watching me flounder about, I should mention that uh, you've seen all the clues. The top line and the bottom line is the actual clue, but that middle line in a different color seems to be unrelated. I mean, unless you're supposed to complete all of the other seven uh, riddles before you come here. It turns out that those words is basically a poem relating to the final boss. Ooh. So they're unrelated to the clue, but they're related to the story at hand. So the poem all put together, what does it say? Well, there is no official, uh, official meaning, but hang on. Yeah, while well, well, you're trying to uh, solve this puzzle here. It's, uh, it's, uh, Master of Shadow and Dark, Stones Have Power of Stars. Complete all seven, so that we, the Great Ones, can live again by the stone. We know the stars spurn us, and that the skies lie, but the stars bring balance. So the crystal stars are the balancing force of the amazing power. Basically. Or, hey, the crystal stars will banish the darkness. So this is me hurriedly going to uh, Chrome to pull up Riddle Tower to see what I need to do, and nonchalantly wa walking around like, yeah, I know, I know what I'm doing. Ha <laughs> ha, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Typing with one hand intensifies. <laughs> <laughs> scroll, scroll. Uh, come on. Uh, <laughs> come on. Come on. I, I can't look like a fool on the internet. I'm supposed to reset the room. I knew it. I, I got it wrong you the had first time. It. Yes. So now, now I got. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Beyond, 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 beyond. beyond. Uh, before, 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 and now we have hey. summoned the great demon key. Don't I feel like a dummy? You big dumb dummy, you jester! Hooray! So uh, now that we have all eight badges, now we can face the elite four. Well, again, there's nothing we can do here anymore because the the thing I need to put the keys in the thing, we don't have. Is this the Mario Thousand Year Door equivalent of blue balls? <laughs> Come on, no, I, I, was, I was raring to go with these riddles and we solved them all, or you solved them all, and now we can't move on? Because we got to do one more thing. Again, we were early in coming here. We were supposed to continue on in the plaza. Probably fight another boss, yes? Y yes, fight another boss, get the thing, come back here, then do the riddles, then do the thing, then there you go. So you, you sequence broke and then went back to fix it. <laughs> yes, I need the Gorilla Glue to fix the sequence again. <laughs> and the Gorilla Glue being the star key. But those riddles are done, and we can't, and uh, they will always be done because we have the keys. So that's all good. And let's just continue on then, I guess. Who gets those coins that you give to the health box? Shigeru Miyamoto. Ah, so does this game have microtransactions? Yes, but only with the fake money. Oh, thank God. So they're pulling a WarioWare gold. I think that would Wait. effectively kill the Paper Mario franchise. I mean, it's been, like, on its last gasp for a while. Origami <laughs> King, you know, made it live for a few more months. But if they were to put microtransactions in a mobile free-to-play <laughs> title for Paper Mario, that would kill it. I mean, you already have Mario Kart on mobile, and it's kind of it's kind of disgusting with its It's kind of awful. Grabbing. Yeesh. It's, it's kind of very, very awful. 
Why would mm -hmm. you ever want to play Mario Kart Tour when Mario Kart 8 Deluxe still exists? Ooh, wow. This enemy's cool. I mean, it's probably a jerk to fight, but I'm yeah, not Yeah, he is, but I'm not gonna deal with that. Eh, 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 eh. Man, times sure were simpler back in 2005. <laughs> Push the button, make the thing happen! And you don't have to go through a bunch of hoops just to attack things. It's, it's just fantastic. There he is. Only for five experience, wow. This is just a big long quarter to our next boss fight. Which is... Uh, right here. Whoa! Hi. <laughs> well, you tried. I did try. I don't think it would have mattered anyway, because I think only the hammer really works best on this guy. Damn, that does a lot. Goombella, what are you doing? Stop! Ugh. Youch. As a big metal ball on a spike. She's wearing a helmet. She's good. It's like a tether bar Mario, of no! teeth. Oh my god, dude. Come on. I, f I feel quite foolish. I'm sorry. <laughs> There's that jester coming through in Ultra Director Jester's name. <laughs> hey, he's just japing with you guys. It's all right. It's fine. Boom! I like the little party popper effect that happens whenever you do something correct. Hey, genius guy, got it! Hooray! Yay! He knows how to play the paper game! All right! I know how to play a game for children! Man, imagine if there was a children's game that was extremely condescending like that. How many kids would just, like, end up in shambles because of that? Especially if it was know. their favorite it's... paper man. I don't know, those fucking Dora the Explorer games can get pretty condescending. You did it! Wow! I yes, didn't yes. think you had can the mental capacity! Can we move on? Please, please, can we move on? Amazing job! I get it, I get it, I You're get Dora's it! You're Dora's special friend! <laughs> then when you get something wrong, a deleted scene said, Get fucked, loser! <laughs> you know, I think I would pay good money to watch, you know, the, the voice <laughs> actors and stars of, uh... <laughs> of, of all of our favorite Nick Jr. and early children's TV shows. <laughs> Just getting raunchy as all hell. I mean, I can imagine a Steve from Blue's Clues flipping the bird. I mean, he's a rock star now, so he doesn't give a fuck. Well, Steve's cool, though, so... Well, that's what I mean. It's just like... It, like People you grew up with all of a sudden, you know, acting like the adults that they are. You see the, the clown from the big comfy couch just shooting up H. <laughs> <laughs> I just imagined it going back to do uh, the door of the explorer thing. I need uh, your help. Can you shut your mouth and fuck off? Just reminds you me can. Of the Great. <laughs> reminds me of the robot chicken sketch. But uh, I think everybody's seen that clip. Don't, of, uh, no, 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 no. Ah! Good lord. What the? Oh, that was confusion. That's pretty yes! funny. Stop. Mario, no! Okay, has everybody seen the clip of uh, the voice actor for Plankton just saying, uh, <laughs> eating the, at the we chum bucket? We got good shit, yes. <laughs> Every fucking day. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you're back. Doug Lawrence is great, though. <laughs> and then we got Clancy Brown cussing up a storm in uh, <laughs> Detroit Become Human, which is really funny. Well, that's a safe block. We got a big boss fight coming up, so, uh... Ah. Next time on Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door... Boss fights galore. See you next time. Can you fight the boss without dying? Answer in the next episode.